The premier basketball championship for high school will go down this week in East Rutherford, New Jersey at American Dream. Tournament is called The Throne. It will feature the top boys teams in the country, 16 of them, and also eight of the top girls teams in the country. And here with me to talk all about this is the head coach of Camden High School boys team, Malik Wayans, also former Villanova Wildcat. Malik, what's going on, man? How you doing? What's going on? Thanks, man. Good to see you, man. Thank you for having me. Yeah, man. Good to see you. I'm glad to to have you here to talk about all this. And Malik, you know, I got to ask this because your school, Camden, they produce some great players over the years. What does it mean for you as a coach to coach your players and compete this week in the throne? Um, it's a great honor, man. It's our second year actually competing in the throne. So I know what it's all about. Um, my guys are super excited for it. It's a great event. Um, I think it's great. I think, you know, to add some like March Madness style, um, you know, basketball to high school basketball. And um, we're trying to go out there and, you know, compete at the highest level. Yeah, you guys want to compete there at the highest level. I got to ask you about this because for people who don't know, American Dream, it's a mall. You're going to be playing a basketball tournament inside of a mall. Is this tournament being played at the American Dream? Is this the most unique tournament that you've ever played or coached in in terms of a venue? And what do you think about this venue? Definitely, man. It's definitely, you know, the most unique um, style tournament I've ever been a part of. Um, I, I, it has to be exciting. I've actually been to American Dream Mall with my kids, you know, at the, uh, the indoor water park and the amusement park and things like that. So I'm really excited. It should be great, man. It's not, I'm, I'm sure it's like nothing else like it. You know, um, I never heard of anything being in the mall with this type of, you know, venue. So I think it should be, you know, really exciting for the fans. Yeah, it should be exciting for the fans. I had a chance to check out when they had the curling competition, Malik, there at American Dream, and it was pretty interesting to see how they set it up with the rink, and then they took the rink down, and now they have hardwood on the, on there, and everybody will get to play. So it's going to be very interesting. I'm excited to see everybody competing. And speaking of competing, you've got some of the top programs, not just in this local area, New York and New Jersey, but also across the country. So when you look at the competition that's here, Malik, what is it going to take – for your team, Camden, what's it going to take for you guys to win it all? I'm just doing what we do. Um, you know, coming and playing, you know, a full 32 minutes of Camden basketball. Um, that's what we like to harp on. Um, you know, we try to say our next game is our biggest game. Obviously, we know we're playing a great opponent in Ridgeview, um, who's nationally ranked and, um, you know, had a great year themselves. But I think we just got to come out, you know, play hard, play together, um, defend and rebound. And um, I think we, we should be in pr- pretty good shape. All right, so you guys sound ready. I'm going to move a little bit just for a second off of high school basketball and go to college basketball because you are a former Villanova Wildcat. I assume that you've had your eye on the NCAA tournament the past couple of days. What do you think of what we saw in the NCAA tournament, the first and second round on the men's side this past weekend? Man, always exciting. Always, you know, always um, different you know, upsets and things like that. Um, obviously, my guys, you know, that was at Canada last year, took a loss at Kentucky. I, I was pretty upset about that. But um, it's just great to watch great basketball, great coaching. Um, you know, I just enjoy March Madness. I, I was a part of it, playing in it. And now to watch it, um, it's really great. I actually, I like, you know, UConn, Purdue, Houston. I like one of those three to, you know, go all the way. Okay, UConn, Purdue, or Houston to go all the way. I think people would like to see that. Got some some Big East love in there as well, too. Last thing for me, Coach, I got to ask you, as a coach, somebody who's played high school basketball, college basketball at a high level, right, you're a former McDonald's All-American. This is your second year competing in the throne, second year of existence. What would it mean to you as a coach to win it all, to be named the best high school basketball team in the country? Everything. Um, you know, we grind every day. You know, we come, you know, every day to work to be the best team we could be by the end of the year. So for us even getting the opportunity, you know, to compete for the, you know, to be c- considered the best team in the country, um, you know, you got to go out there and leave, leave everything you got. So um, I think my guys are excited. I'm excited. And um, I think we're going to give it our all and do everything we can to come out with the championship. All right, there you go. We're going to be looking to see you guys give it your all. The Throne goes down at American Dream March 27th through the 30th. You can get your tickets for that at AmericanDream.com. Check that out. Malik Wayans, his Tigers, they're going to be competing in it. They're going for the title there. Malik, got to wish you guys good luck. I'm hoping to get down there to catch a game, so hopefully I'll see you at the Throne. Man, appreciate it. Um, hopefully I'll see you there. Um, hopefully we can get get it done. Yes, sir. Good luck. Thank you, man.